Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Shukar Singh. We are reading Lamar. We are making life meaningful day by day. We are on day 69. Let's get started. Day 69. Quote, the gods are so overwhelmed by the pleasure that they have no way of knowing the nature of suffering and no way to practice dharma. End quote, Lama Zohar Rinpoche. Text. It is easy to see that as a hell being, hungry ghost or animal, it is almost impossible to create any virtuous action. But also as a long life god, either in the desire realm, distracted by pleasure, or in the form in the formless realm, absorbed in concentration, it is extremely difficult to see the nature of suffering and therefore extremely difficult to practice dharma. Unless we see its faults, how can we renounce samsara? The world of desire realm gods is free from the problems that we experience, having to work to feed ourselves, having to expend energy to be comfortable and happy. Every pleasure comes to them effortlessly. With all this luxury, their minds are constantly distracted by sense pleasure and they have no thoughts other than what to experience next. We can see this a little bit in our own life, where we can easily be distracted from meditation by thoughts of the new car or computer we want to buy or the movie or restaurant we are going to that night. The main problem, of course, is attachment. Material possessions bring with them attachment. With attachment comes the mind that always wanders to the object of attachment. This becomes a huge distraction when we try to practice dharma. Contemplating the suffering of the gods, even with their unbelievable pleasures, helps us to appreciate how precious this human life is. Only with this perfect human rebirth can we practice the dharma. No god can, no animal can, no hungry ghost can, and certainly no hell being can. We should feel this deeply in our heart and determine never to waste even a second of this life. The three recalls of the day are, it is very difficult for the gods to see the nature of suffering and practice dharma. We can see for ourselves how material possessions bring attachment and distraction. Contemplating the suffering of the gods helps us appreciate this precious human life. Well, I hope you have a very great day or night wherever you are. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.